here we are. Thank you. Thanks for bringing me home. Oh, you're welcome. It was a really good, really good dinner. Thanks. It's delicious. Yeah, no problem. You know, I'm super, super tired. Like, my body is so exhausted. I think it's time to go home. Oh, well, you know something? I'm sure you're beautiful any time of day. <laughs> you know yeah. something? In fact, I would say that you're much prettier than Lisa Mays. Wow. I <laughs> absolutely love the dark makeup on your eyes. And God, I love how you smell. <laughs> Thank you. Where'd you say you were from again? Oh, the um, the north end of the valley. Some of the calls sometimes take me over that way, but uh, nobody I know still lives out there anymore. Right. So, um, you're from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, right? Yeah, I am. <laughs> Do you want me to come upstairs? Maybe we can finish our conversation. Well, you know it's late, and you know I'm really tired, so maybe maybe okay. another time. Okay. Well, thanks again, really, for coming out to talk. Of course. You see, the uh, place that I'm in now is mm -hmm. that I want a relationship with someone I can team up with and share. Mm -hmm. Kind of like how we share the same hours and the same job and whatnot. Mm -hmm. I could run that a laundry list, but I'm sure you get the idea. <laughs> well, I hope you find someone I really do. Well, here's the thing about that, Nina. I'm, I'm, I'm quite certain that I already have. Whoa, okay. So I just want to be perfectly clear and super polite about this but you do know that i only came to dinner with you as a professional courtesy right well thank you because i don't think it's a secret that i've single-handedly raised a unit price in your ratings book my ratings book price i'm a very fast learner nina you know we had a conversation and i specifically mentioned that do you remember i do well, yes i do mm -hmm. i i recently learned for instance that um most americans watch the local news to stay informed Local crime stories as you led the news and filled 14 times the broadcast and um, KSML, your network, yeah. relies heavily on such stories. We do. You know, with Los Angeles crime rates going down, I think that makes items like mine particularly valuable. Mm -hmm. Like rare animals. I imagine your needs will only increase during the next week's rating sweeps period. Well, we certainly appreciate what we do for us. Thank you so much, though. You know, there are certain good things in being alone. Mm -hmm. Like, you have time to do all the things you want to do, like study and plan, but uh, you can't have dinners like this. Or be physical with a person. Right. I mean, of course, beyond a flirtation ship. Where are you going with this? I want that with you. Like, you want to keep your job and your health insurance. <laughs> I'm going to make this perfectly clear to you, okay? I don't need you to keep my fucking job, okay? You're the news director on the Vampire Shift at the lowest rated station in L.A. Now, I have to think that you're invested in this transaction. <laughs> and where did you get the balls to suggest well, something like on. this? Hold on, we're still talking here. There's nothing left to say. Well, then you can leave. <sighs> okay, look. You've done really well at the station, and, and we pay you well, very well. If you want, I can get you an exclusive retainer on top of your segment fees, of course. And I can get you a job as a production assistant at the station. That way you can learn the business from the inside out. You did say your interests lie there. Just check it out and see how it goes. You're not listening, Nano. I happen to know that you haven't stayed at one station for more than two years at a time. And you're coming up on two years soon. So I can imagine that you have a contract for that length of time. And the ratings during the next week will directly affect that. <laughs> Hold on a second. Are you threatening that I, I... I'm negotiating. You're threatening to stop selling to me. That's your choice, Nina. You see, the true price of any item is what someone is willing to pay. You want something, mm -hmm. and I want you. To fuck you. And as a friend. Jesus Christ. Friends don't make friends fucking sleep with them. Actually, that's wrong, you know, because I'm sure, as you know, a friend is a gift you give yourself. 